I'm James Morton, I've just finished recording my Funklix Series 4. This is another funky backing track recorded here at the ProMusicTutor.com studio. It features Johnny Henderson on Hammond organ and also Denny Eilert on guitar. And Denny uh, teaches a whole bunch of series on our guitar side. So this fourth Funk Lick series is in a different key. Each one of these series is in a different key. I've chosen to do this one in a slightly harder key. This is in concert A, which for us alto players is in F sharp. This is a tricky key to play in, but it's also one of the most popular keys for guitarists and vocalists to work in. So it's really important for us to get to grips with these more challenging keys at some point. And here is a good way to learn how to do that by playing along with this funky backing track and getting some comfortable things underneath your fingers in this alto F sharp key. very useful to have some licks under your fingers in this key of concert A, that's F sharp for alto key, because guitarists love to play in A. And if you find yourself facing a situation uh, where suddenly it's very likely guitarist calls a song in a jam situation, plays a blues in A, after this series you will have some really cool licks under your fingers which you can pull out the bag straight away. So it's good to be able to familiarise yourselves in some of these more tricky keys because they're often very common keys for guitarists and vocalists. The purpose of these Funk Licks series is to give you vocabulary um, so with them teaching you phrases and licks and some rhythmic language too. Um, so they're different to the improvisation series because there's less teaching of concepts of improvising, less theory. It's more about language, it's more about learning some cool phrases that you can then apply in these in certain situations. <laughs> So this set of funky licks that I'm going to show you in this series, once you've learnt them, you can put them into practice straight away um, and be, uh, be playing them at a jam session later on today. Every lick I show you first without the backing track, then I break it down, explain when it comes in, what beat in the bar you should play it go through the fingerings, break the lick up into different sections and try and explain it as clearly as I can. And then at the end of each lesson, I then demonstrate the licks shown within that lesson um, with the backing track in context so you can feel, hear and see um, how these licks fit into place with the groove. <laughs> Music is a language and we constantly need to uh, expand our vocabulary so that we can communicate uh, in a cool way, uh, in a funky way in this case too. So um, this is a tricky key and hopefully these licks will equip you with some really cool licks that you can bust out and, uh, and uh, be creative with in your own way. I hope you like the licks and phrases from this Funk Licks Series 4. Um, you'll be able to put them straight into your playing um, and use them immediately. Um, so I'm sure you'll find them very useful. I'm James Morton, this is ProMusicTutor.com. If you want to learn how to play like the pros, then learn from the pros.